Hey, 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 hey. Howdy. <gasps> it's kind of funny if you could, oh, I lost a slipper. Hello, this is Taylor. Okay, how did we get here? What's up, YouTube? <laughs> this is Matt. <bad. laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Please, please don't put me on YouTube. I, I'm actually so camera shy. What's up, YouTube? These are my friends. This is Fesh. Hey. This is Dan. Hey. That's Richa. Hello. <laughs> we are en route. Uh, we just got a little Duncan. We're in Jersey now, right? Jersey, baby. Jersey, baby. The best state in the union. <laughs> the morale is good. Hey. Hi. Look, your skin looks immaculate. Yeah, this can be in it. Boom. <laughs> the comment on my skin. So for a little background on this trip, Wander gave me and a group of my friends a stay at their amazing Hudson Valley, New York house, which you'll see here in just a second. But yeah, here's a quick message from Taylor from the future about said house. By the way, stay tuned to the end of the, <laughs> stay till the, end of the video to find out how you and some friends could win a free three day getaway at one of these wonder locations. So our first stop on the way up to the house was the Franklin D. Roosevelt Presidential Library, which was a little less than a two hour drive out of New York City. Dan, how's morale? Strong. Good. It's so cold. Oh, no room for turtles here. <laughs> She's a YouTuber. Welcome to the Welcome. FDR library. What if we kiss with the FDR? <laughs> Just kidding. I'm left. I'm left. Hi, Alex. Decaf. <laughs> Are you holding court here or what, Taylor? Yes, I am. <laughs> Transition. Ah, <laughs> you know, Shravan is gonna narrate the whole entire thing. He's like a pro at this stuff, expert on multiple presidents, FDR especially. He begins. <laughs> so these are all friends of mine from college. We were all actually in the same program in college, and despite the fact that we seem like a group of insane goofballs most of the time. <laughs> this is actually one of the most intellectually curious groups of people that I know. Believe it or not. <laughs> After officially breaking the record for the most excited group of people in their mid-twenties to ever enter the FDR museum, we drove like four minutes to check out the Vanderbilt mansion before heading to our house. Howdy. <laughs> now we're at the Vanderbilt family mansion. This is one of them, so I was told. It's so cold. What would you estimate it is right now? 15. 15. Lower. You think lower? I think lower. Oh my god, wow. It's so sick. It is beautiful. On our final stretch to the house, we lucked out with an incredibly beautiful sunset, but my other group of friends in the second car ran into some problems. They were driving an electric car and the insanely cold weather was draining the battery faster than normal, and we were kind of in the middle of nowhere, only really driving through these small towns so they couldn't find a charging station. It was almost really bad, but eventually they found a charging station where they could leave the car overnight. So we packed into one car and headed to the house together where we got our priority street. Who wants to Wait. My chefs, how's it going? Oh, it's going. How's it going? It's going, it's going, it's going. It's going. It's going. And now for the official house tour. Hello, this is Taylor. <laughs> Welcome to my fourth humble abode, apparently, on this channel. Kidding, it's not mine. But you guys know I like to pretend I have these multi-million dollar mansions. Well, here's another one. Here we are in Hudson Valley, which is a couple hour drive north of New York City. We came up last night, me and a little group of my friends, and we're staying at this beautiful wonder house, and I wanna show it to you guys. Let's, uh, let's take a look. First and foremost though, before we go in, house comes with a Tesla, which is pretty cool. More on that later. And the overall edifice, I would say, is a nice uh, modern, modern look and structure. Oh, by the way, they did show their whole renovation process of these places on their YouTube channel. Go check it out if you want, but um, let's check out the guts of the place, shall we? Come on in. <laughs> Welcome. I remember when we said everything will happen. Welcome to the guts. <laughs> First and foremost, as you guys saw in the B-roll I just played, Absolutely stunning entrance. These are the cat skills, I think, right? Is that right? Boom, let's go. That's the thing, I know everything about the West Coast. I know every little inch of California. New York, not as much. So, uh, oh, there's a, there's a map. There's a map. Can reference that later as needed. Here we are, like I said, in Hudson Valley. I'll show you guys where it is on a map. I'll maybe put up a little graphic here or something like that. Two hour drive north. So this is just the perfect place to come if you live in the city, need a little break. And um, that's what I'm doing this weekend. So let's start off in the kitchen. Come on over. <laughs> this place has literally, literally, anything you could want. Come take a look at the built-in appliances and the innards of the appliances. How cute, how cute is this? I love like tiny little, 
I love small things. These were all full. I was just having a grand old time looking through here yesterday. We made some brownies last night. I bought these for the drive up. <laughs> Do you guys know black and white cookies? They're a New York thing, right? Are they a New York thing? I don't even know. I like them a lot. And along with all the things that you could want, every Wander House comes with a half-eaten bag of Cheetos, so. <laughs> Not actually, we have one. Every Wander House does, though, come with an espresso machi mach machine. I can't talk today. An espresso machine, close enough, with pods. Had a couple of these this morning, got jittery. That's fine, I don't mind it. Anyway, so we drove up here and it was, it was over the top cold. So anyway, our first priority was getting in the hot tub as soon as we got here last night. Here it is. <laughs> it's still hot. It's not on, so the insulation is just insane. These are my glasses, I don't know why they're there. I'll leave them there though for now. And then over here, a lovely patio. You know, probably nicer to use in the summer if we're being honest. Would you want to sit in this? What do, you, what do you guys think? But now let's go in, let's look at the living room. Let's look at the bedrooms. Let's look at the workstations because there's a lot of stuff here. So next thing I want to show you guys is the fireplace. Priority number one last night was getting in the hot tub. I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to say it was anything else. This was priority number two. I love a good fireplace and the smell. Just lovely. After we had some snacks, jacuzzi last night, we came here, we played Comes With The House. <laughs> they have a number of other games here too, which is awesome. My team didn't do too well, beside the point. I'm still not over it. Now let me show you my bedroom. Or actually there's a half bath here, so I'll show you the bathroom first. <laughs> Come on in. Nice. I'll show you guys the primary, the primary bedroom. It is, uh, it's kind of stunning actually. Like imagine waking up, that being your view. Look how cool this is. This is gold. I want this when I'm older. Check this out. Oh! Isn't that cool? And then over here, this is what is so great about these wonder properties is that they come fully equipped in multiple spots in the house with amazing like state-of-the-art working stations. Full-size monitors, speakers, microphone, everything you could want, everything I could want to edit a video or to work on my consulting job, which would really, I just need the monitor for that. Depending on your work, you could come here if you're a remote worker, stay for the weekend and get everything you need to get done here and have a beautiful view while you're doing it. This is a standing desk with this wood. Did you see this? That's so cool. I kind of figured it wouldn't be a standing desk just by nature of it being like a nice slab of wood. That's awesome. And then a telescope, which I haven't used. I should do that later because there's not as much light pollution up here, obviously. Moving on. I don't know why I'm out of breath. <laughs> We're not doing anything physically strenuous at all. Oh, let me show you the bathroom real quick. Oh, so lovely. We got the dual shower heads. And if you're getting winded for no good reason like me, you can take a seat when you, <laughs> when you need a little break. We got his and hers sink. Love. <laughs> Lots of storage. These places come with like Dyson hair dryers. I think there was a sewing kit in here I saw. They think of everything. They think of everything. The houses also come with robes. It's inside out at the moment, but because <laughs> we wore it last night. Super comfy, very luxurious, like thick. You know, it just feels high quality. So like I was telling you earlier, these houses are especially good for remote workers. This could literally be like a podcast room. The acoustics in here are pretty good too. Got a nice chair, a view to the outside. All good things, some books. Oh, Angela Duckworth. She was one of my professors at Penn. Take a look. Grit. Now let's go downstairs. I'll show you guys a couple of the extra rooms that we have and a couple little surprises down there too. Okay, here we are. Starting all the way over here, we have a lovely bathroom. Not much else to say, but very nice. With temperature control, obviously. Come on in here, we have another bedroom with uh, its own patio, which I think is pretty sick. There are stairs like down to, you can take it down to the pond. The aforementioned stairs are here. <laughs> and that's the patio to my primary bedroom up there. Anyway, moving along. I should also mention the smell of this place. It just has that really fresh, like nice hotel smell. That's what it smells like here. Of course it does, you know? A whole second living room, love. Another bedroom, we probably don't have to go in every single one, but once again, Okay. <laughs> Is that a Speedo? I think that's my friend Speedo. Like I said, Jacuzzi was priority number one last night. <laughs> Another nice work from home station. Just, they think of everything. They do. Let me turn the light off, that bothers me. <laughs> and now I mentioned there was a little surprise down here, something you might not expect. Is this another bedroom? <laughs> No, it's not. It is like a proper gym. And then here's the special surprise, a sauna. 
Are you kidding me? Probably gonna do jacuzzi again tonight and then sauna because why not? If you ever wanna explore other parts of the house, you could come and just sit here if you wanted to. Pretty much everything in the house, but I'll show you some specific little features now. Come on back up. Something else you can do from the iPad. <laughs> Literally everything. Every single room, every single kind of light. Ready? And on. Boom. Also, Wonder has a personal concierge. I've been texting them with some questions <laughs> since we got here last night, and they respond super quickly. So, we're driving the Tesla now. I've never driven one before in my life. And I didn't think it was on. I was like, there's no way the engine is on. It is silent. Anyway, adjusting my mirrors now for safety. <laughs> oh my God, there's heating on the steering wheel. Ah! Okay, ready? Don't tell you. This is such a smooth ride. <gasps> I'm gonna buy one of these <laughs> at one point in my life. Oh, so smooth. <gasps> I love this. Are you having fun, Dan? The most. <laughs> the most? The, um, cool. <laughs> okay, that's good. Can I test the horsepower a little bit? Whatever you want. Do you want me to fill this? Oh my god. Oh my god! I barely had to touch the accelerator. <laughs> that is nice. <laughs> I love this so much! Are you warm? Is your, heat, your seat warmer on? My ass is warm. All right, so is mine. <laughs> it's like toast. Do you want me to shut yours off? No, it's nice. I like it. All right, we just parked. <laughs> Dan and I didn't know that you just... You, you have to walk out of the Tesla and it locks itself, or it doesn't lock itself, but it turns itself off. Something nice about having a key in the ignition to just turn off. Anyway, I'm old fashioned. <laughs> but now going to meet our other friends for dinner. I absolutely love this little corner. It actually reminds me of my favorite wine bar in West Village. Cozy, look at those people working. I love it. Hello. Taylor here in the hot tub, as mentioned earlier. So I wanna tell you guys how you can enter to win a free three night stay at one of these insane Wonder locations here in the US. But first, thank you again to Wonder for partnering with me on this video. This was a super fun weekend. I think they're doing such cool things to make remote and hybrid work just really fun and exciting to be able to do it from different locations like this. Also, Wonder owns all of their properties, so you know what you're getting, you know you're gonna have an amazing stay. So to enter to win a free three night stay at one of these locations for you and three of your friends, just go to wonder.com slash Taylor, create an account and it's important that you create an account instead of just going to the link because they need to have your email to contact you and they will announce the winner on march 31st so go create the account and perhaps stay at one of these super cool places <laughs> thank you guys for watching until next time turtle out by the way don't forget to like this video if you enjoyed whatsoever and subscribe to the channel for zero dollars for more fun content like this well I, I shouldn't say she was one of my professors i took a seminar Close enough. <laughs> okay, that's good. I'll come back and get my slipper. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It's so <laughs>